Hello, and thank you for renting a trailer from Vans or Bands Limited. If you've rented a vehicle with one of our trailers, it will already be coupled before you uh, come to pick the vehicle up. However, you should be happy that the trailer is correctly coupled to the van before you drive it away. When you're out on the road, you might have the need to drop the trailer off the vehicle or change some of the light bulbs. To uncover your trailer, start off by loosening the securing handle for the drop wheel and dropping it to just above floor height. Then, re-tighten it so it's nice and secure. Next, uncouple the electrics and make sure they're nice and cleanly out of the way. Go then, you get the key off the van to undo the trailer lock. Next, pull the pin out of the jockey wheel Pull back the handle on the coupling and lift it. You can then wind down the jockey wheel to lift the vehicle off the total. Last thing you do is you uncouple the safety breakaway chain. The trailer can then be pushed away from the van. Once you've removed the trailer, you may wish to leave it separately from the van. For this reason, we provide you with a wheel clamp. It comes in three separate parts. The round yellow bit, the sort of chlory yellow bit, and the long silver bit. The easiest wheel to put this on we found is the front right. So you open up the claws on the chlory bit, the round bit, in like that. You then need to feed this around the back of the front wheel. Watching out for the chassis rod. Once in this position, the claw goes into the closest hole, through the device, and out the other side. Once you've got it tight, line the lock up with the hole. It's easier, sometimes easier said than done. And push it in. Then secure, and it can't be rolled away and no one can get to the wheel nuts. Recoupling is basically the reverse. You can either pull the trailer back to the van or have someone uh, back you up to it. Go back on the safety cable, line up the uh, coupling over the tow on the vehicle, pull back the catch once again, and lower the vehicle onto the tow Once it's clicked on, it's advisable just to wind the jockey wheel back out a little bit until the back of the van starts to lift. This way, you know the coupling is securely on the van. You can then fully wind the jockey wheel back up, making sure nothing's caught in it. And the little pin on this side is located in the coupling. Then, once it's fully up, Yard clip. Back in. Undo the handle again. To fully raise the jockey wheel. Making sure the tight handle is done up nice and tight. Lastly, you can then reconnect the electrics. And then Double check that all the lights then work. This simply consists of turning on the headlights, brake lights, fog lights and indicators to make sure the corresponding lights on the trailer illuminate. If they don't, they might have blown a bulb and need replacing. If you do have to change the bulbs, just simply remove the three screws with the screwdriver located in the toolkit in the front of the van. You can then pull the light lens off to gain clean access to the bulbs. Simply take out the affected bulb and replace it with one of the ones located in the glove box. When putting them back in, please make sure they make good contact, otherwise even a brand new bulb won't work. And just simply put the cover back on and replace the screws. If you have any problems with that, please contact us on 01865 670 601 or on our 24-hour emergency line. Unfortunately, our breakdown services do not count blown bulbs as breakdowns. So please call us if you have any problems. Thank you.